Hello again, and welcome back to Illegally Sighted. This is BGFH, and I am back for another VR game video, and boy howdy, I have a real interesting one today. Um, a game called Street Champ. Street Champ, as you see up there, nice big old floating logo there. So, this came out as I'm recording this not very long ago on the Oculus Store. I was perusing the categories and uh, I saw this for a couple of bucks. I don't remember how much it cost, but it wasn't expensive. Maybe a couple bucks tops. And I thought, oh, Street Champs, okay, it's going to be some sort of a racing game. Went to the store page and watched the trailer and knew that is not what this is. And I gotta give the devs credit, I would have never thought to make a game like this in VR. Because in a way, like, I get it on a phone or on a, like, on a flat screen, like, like an overhead, you're sort of separated from what's actually happening. But let me, let me, let me, let me just show you, let me just show you what uh, Street Champ is. We're gonna hit A. We are in first person. We are on the edge of a city street. If we look back, there's our building over there. We got some buildings. We got a big ass interstate going over here. We got a fire hydrant off to our left. And guess what we get to do? We get to dodge traffic. We get to play first person VR Frogger. Holy shit. Ah, uh, no. Yeah, we get to play first-person Frogger Crossy Road. <laughs> That's what we're doing. Uh, so there's your uh, stats and things like that, uh, which unfortunately, again, don't have head tracking. This is a very simple interface game. Um, so there's no head tracking. I cannot lean in. The contrast is fine, but the text size for me is not readable, and I am not able to lean in to read any of that if I wanted to. So, boo. However, at least the one good thing is it took me some experimenting to figure this out. And maybe if there was like if I'm as able to read that screen, it might have told me that. But if I hit the back button, it will jump me right back in. So I don't have to I don't have to um you know hold my you know, try to aim a pointer and, Oh god, no, really? I I was literally a step away from that damn sidewalk. Alright, let's do it again. Yeah, first person Frogger or Crossy Road. I'm getting robbed. I'm like inches away from a safe haven, like the last two times. Okay, two lanes of traffic. Let's do this. Okay. And, uh. Okay, we're safe. Okay, we're good. So it's all random. Like sometimes you get like one or two lanes. Sometimes you, oh geez. Sometimes you get a whole hell of a long thing to cross like there. Like I don't even know where they Oh, okay, no, we got a safe haven, okay. So it looks, okay, you just gotta watch for, and if the problem is my view keeps adjusting itself on its own, which is really frustrating. I keep, you know, it center, it recenters itself on its own, but there's not a whole lot of head tracking, so I can't really lean ahead to lean around this stupid bush here, so I can see what, oh, whoa, and then the dude just jumped again, okay, screw it, we're going, go, 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 yeah, okay, here we go, all right, so, ah, uh, this doesn't look good at all, I don't like this, this, okay, that first lane, is really slow, and then we got a second lane, all right, fuck it, we're going, no, I, you don't really want to hold down the A button, so, the, okay, let me can explain the controls, it's really, really simple, basically, um, you hit the A button to cross one lane of traffic, so, be it a safe zone or an actual lane of traffic, um, when you look left or right, 
<clears throat> it doesn't matter. It's not, you're not moving in the direction that you look. You're always just going to be shooting straight ahead, but you have to really look really fast to the left and the right to actually figure out, you know, watch the flow of traffic and try not to die. Like I said, there's something really just oddly fascinating about this. Like, yeah, we've had Frogger, we've had Crossy Road, we've had things like that. But, you know, simple graphics and everything, but at the same time, this is like, it's life scale. Like, the, the, the cars are, you know, they're not realistic. Or anything. You know what I mean? They're they're not, um, they look like animated cars, you know, they don't look like real, uh, realistic graphics. But it does, oh shit, oh, that, 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 that was, there's no way I was gonna get out of that. Um, but again, like, the, the three dimensions, the scale of these cars, um, makes it like it doesn't matter you know like when i was playing that jump game like it doesn't matter that the buildings are flatly shaded or whatever it what oh. yeah it just doesn't matter like it, it's still <laughs> i could see where this would be terrifying for somebody this is a horror game oh yeah go to, yeah go ahead play dodge, dodge traffic yeah go ahead no get the hell oh come on See, you can only move one speed, and I thought I was going to get by in the nick of time, and each lane of traffic is randomly sped. Oh, God. Uh-oh, now we're bound. Yes, I was stuck on the left on the first lane. The second lane, I was stuck on the right. I can't sidestep as far as I know. Um, one thing that is frustrating to me about this game is there's no recenter view, and depending on where I'm looking, like when I'm done with a match, like the, the stat screen could just be in a random, ran, uh oh, like in a random part. So there's like, it doesn't feel like a consistency to it. And the, like I said, the, the view tends to center itself fairly often, more often than it should. So you're, you're looking somewhere and then it just kind of jumps and that can be really disorienting, especially when you're trying to judge traffic. Okay. So, oh boy. We got, okay, we got that lane, we got that, okay, we got that's pretty good. Get in there, go, 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 yeah, okay. One, two, three, well, three or four lanes here, okay. Man, this is rough. Go, 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 get behind the bus, there we go, all right. Two lanes, don't screw this up. Okay, so we got that, that's a slow lane. Actually, what I want, I want to sit here for a minute, I want to see, okay, so that one, yeah, they're all moving now. I'm trying to determine if the car, like, if one lane, all the cars drive at the same speed, or if each car in each lane is random. Oh yeah, they gotta be random. That the red one that just passed me was flying. Okay. Oh yeah. All right. Go. No. All right. There we go. Yeah, I'm just trying to learn here. Okay, that's one lane. We can do that. <coughs> Two lanes. Of course they're going the separate way. At least these bushes are smaller so I can look over them. Alright, go, 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 yeah. Yeah, see this is not bad when we actually have two lanes or so. Okay, where are you coming from? You're gonna be okay, you're a left. You're a left side. Oh, no, I'm not gonna chance it. Go away, bus. Short bus. Alright, another lane. Another short bus. School bus. Alright, we got a truck. We got 
four or five lanes. Oh boy. Okay. This is going. This is going to suck. Okay. Oh man. Oh god. No. Why did I? Why? 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 Why did I? Mm, I hit the A button in panic when I just I saw the truck out of the corner of my eye. I shouldn't have moved, and I would have been fine. I think. I could have made that. Oh. It does have this one more time, one more time kind of thing going. Run, 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 run. Yeah. That was a dangerous prospect there. Okay. Yeah. All right. Risking a little bit here. Okay, that bus goes. Stop. Frick. That one's... Well, we've got some safe, I see some safe zones up there. But it's still a ways away, that's a lot of lanes. Oh, brother! Oh, shit! No! Ah! No, I don't want to... Oh, God. I was so glad something didn't come on that left lane. Or, I call it a left lane, but like when I say left lane, I mean somebody coming from the left. Man, this is brutal. <laughs> okay, so we got things. See, okay, go, go, go. Fuck. Okay, okay, got that. We got two more lanes to cross. So that one's going. Okay, let's go. Go, 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 go. Yeah. All right. Ooh, now it's going to get ugly again, I think. Mm -hmm. we got a lot of lean. See, yeah, this is where... I don't like this. Oh, I don't like shit. Alright. Couple more times. Let's do... Let's do three more times and we'll wrap up this video. There's really not a lot else to say. I mean, it's, like I said, it's simple graphics. There is hardly any, any interface. I mean, like I said, if there, if it was a clearer indicated to me, like I said, if I was actually able to read, there's probably a tip down there that says, hey, press the back button to uh, restart. Uh, originally, I thought I had to look down at there at that little bar or whatever and hit A or something. And I'm like, well, that's tedious, especially since I can't read it. I see, I can't see a cursor. Um, but yeah, so... All right, let me get resituated here, and let's do a few more of these. So there's really not a lot else to say. Um, but what I will say is that it is definitely unique playing... F oh, crap. I didn't mean to go in that first lane. Now i got to book it. Oh, man. No. Oh, boy. Ah. Come on. Come on. Yeah. Uh-oh. What? I was in that middle thing. Weak. I thought I made it to that island. But no, it is like, you know, all these other games are either isometric or overhead or whatnot. Like, it's a totally different experience when you are actually... It looks like you're, you know, walking height. Uh-oh. Um... You know, and you you don't you can't just look from down or look from above and plan a route. I can't sidestep. I, I, I you know all I can do is hit A, <laughs> and that's kind of the unsettling part about it. All right, we're going. Frick! Mm. I didn't mean to hit it that extra time. All right, three more tries, and then we'll wrap it up. As kind of weird and twisted as this is, uh, I do say it has that kind of addictive quality to it. Oh crap, yeah, that, that doesn't count because that was me just being a freaking idiot. The one thing, but what I was going to start to say is, the one thing that I want to know, I am genuinely curious, I wonder how somebody came up with this idea. Because, like, you know, okay, yeah, people have made Crossy Road, people have made, um, you know, people have made frogger that kind of a thing but it kind of takes like i said it takes on this weird kind of almost morbid like what kind of crazy shit is going on uh when you are actually like 
in first person doom. Like it just has <laughs> it has this whole other feeling to it. And I would have liked to have seen the pitch that the guy made. Like, oh, um, yeah, what if we did a game where it's like actual first person and you're trying to dodge traffic? I can just see the other uh, developers going, wait, say what now? <laughs> it, it just amuses me. Okay, we got that one coming from that way. Okay, we can go. We can go. Yeah, all right. We're gonna run. Ooh, all right, we're in it. All right. We got actually pretty far. One, two, three, four. We got four more lanes to a safe zone. All right, we're doing it. Oh no! Oh god! Okay, yeah! Whoa, okay, now my... See, I really wish the camera stability in this was better because my, my view is just jumping all around. And in the middle of really trying to judge and judge distances and dodge things, that's not helpful. didn't quite make it. What is that? I think I have... I totally lost track because that one lasted forever. Okay, let's say we have two left. Because I know that one didn't count because I was an idiot. So, three productive things, you know? So... Okay, we got that. So, this is... One chance after this. Yeah. Okay. Go. Uh oh. Uh oh. Uh oh. Uh oh. Uh -oh. oh no. You could have slowed. Yeah. Um. I. Th the the brake sound effect actually. Yeah. You hear the brake. By the time you're already getting plowed over. So. You clearly weren't trying to stop that that quickly there guy all right last chance this one's for the gold oh no that was not for the gold because i was i hit the a button and i was just really stupid okay this hopefully this was the real last one <laughs> well at least you know that the game is compelling enough for me to like keep playing it you know as simple as it is and that's the funny thing is like, you know, I don't mind that some of these, you know, people complain that, oh, there's maybe not a whole lot of, uh -oh. not a whole lot of depth. Uh oh, uh oh, oh balls. I didn't know that that was coming from the left. Um, you know, they, they don't, they see it and they're like, oh, well, this is too simple or, you know, it's not a whole lot of depth or whatever. As long as the act of whatever it is you're doing is fun. I don't mind some of these more simple experiences, especially when you're trying to uh -oh, when you're trying to get people into VR for the first time. You know, give them something. You know, even if it is motion based, that something that's easy to understand. This one, you know, tap or hold A and look around and try not to get run over. That that's that pretty much instantly makes sense. <laughs> Dodge traffic. Don't die. All right, for real, this is it. We've gotten far enough. This is totally the last one. Okay, where is the... Okay. Oh, good. Yeah. Okay, and we've got three sidewalks in a row. Okay, we got one lane. Don't do something stupid. Okay, we're on there. we got two lanes. This shouldn't be too bad. I hope. Oh, I should have gone then. Okay. Okay, here we go. Okay, now we got another one lane. All right, we got that car on the right. Boom, going for it. All right, we got one more lane. They're being nice to us right now, knock on wood. <coughs> okay, now we've got like four or five lanes. Okay, we got a couple going that way. Oh, okay, uh, don't. As long as they're all mainly coming from one direction. Okay. Go, go, fuck, go, go. Yes. Okay, I think... 
Ooh. Okay. Oh boy. One, two, three. Okay, this is not so bad. Let's end on a really good note. Oh, balls, man. All right, well, that'll do it. That is Street Champ. It's available on Oculus Rift right now. And I don't remember what it costs, but it's somewhere between like two and five bucks. Uh, I think it was like maybe two, three bucks or something like that definitely worth it's it's really amusing like i said just the the act of like you're actually the perspective of crossing this like endless runner sort of uh you know crossy road sort of thing in virtual reality like where you are life size and like i said the the, the cars aren't realistically rendered or anything like that you know they're they're kind of flat shaded you know cartoon looking cars but it's plenty effective um yeah, <laughs> that's when I saw that in the store, that really caught me by surprise. So, yeah, if you ever wanted to dodge traffic in VR and, uh, you know, not do it in real life and not die, you know, and it was funny, we're not even doing it at a crosswalk. It's like we're jaywalking the whole way across this like crazy interstates or something. But, uh, yeah, the jaywalking simulator uh, in VR. There you go. Hope you guys enjoyed it. Follow me on Twitter at BGFH79. And until next time, I will talk to you guys again later.